unconfirmed reports of an accident at Southland Park. I can't find my boy! Hundreds of family members gathered outside the deserted park today to commemorate the second anniversary of the Southland Park tragedy. The children are pending a full investigation of the park's safety Authorities report at least 30 deaths and close to 100 injuries. Five years since the tragedy closed the gates of Southland Park, but new evidence is claiming malicious prosecution and believes Says he'll be he vindicated at last. Penny of his fortune the so-called defending legal himself eagles from these dream lawsuits. team defending Southland Park all over oh Joe There were people flying everywhere. It was Bonnie Barth. And the victim's Blood. families oh have God. vowed it to appeal the decision. The not guilty. Cleared of all charges. Rick Henderson, first edition. He's expecting you. This way. Rick Henderson. I've been looking forward to this. As have I, Mr. Alexander. Don't let's stand on ceremony. Call me Jack. Rick. Make yourself comfortable, Rick. I'll be right with you. I admire your work. Real journalism. Thanks. I thought we'd start with your thoughts on the White House attack, then discuss your tenure as director of the FBI, post-retirement reflections, whatever, and... Rick. Or if you want to sound off on politics... Rick, my apologies. This interview about me is just a cover for a more sensitive story. I'm sorry to have lured you here under false pretenses, but I couldn't risk a leak. I'm not sure I understand. Don't worry. It's the scoop of the century. If I had a dime for every time I heard that... Listen, please. It begins with a little incident at a vineyard in Chile that caught my eye some time ago. This was a family business. Fernando Delgado and his son Manuel. Well-liked, hard-working men. Have a look at the folder. you saved the secretary. Yes, 
And we found and killed one of Mr. 47's accomplices. He wasn't alone? No. They communicated by radio. What bothered us was the autopsy of the second assassin. He was a Class II clone. Class II? Fully functioning human clones, accelerated to adulthood. But they tend to die within 18 months of maturity. Tell me, just how widespread is human cloning? We can't know for sure, but I'm sure we'll see thousands within a few years. Why? Because of your jackalope president! He wants it legalized! Imagine that. The most insidious weapon the world has ever seen. And he wants to legalize it. <laughs> but the public... The public is an ass. Cloning is the ultimate weapon of mass destruction. It's a terrorist wet dream. But most Americans still support cloning, and... Hopefully, this interview will change a few minds. Maybe it'd help if they knew it was 47 that killed Chad Bingham's son. What? We even had our best agent on the spot. We were ready. Good to hear your voice again, 47. We got worried when you didn't get back to us. It was just a little thing requiring my attention. We've got an extremely delicate mission for you, if you're interested. Mm-hmm. Always interested. Just send me the briefing. The scoop of the century is a couple of wine guys getting whacked in Chile? It wasn't the victims that caught my eye. It was their killer. I believed it was... Mr. 47. The bald killer clone? Come on, Jack. He's an urban legend. Even the CIA and your own FBI say he doesn't exist. We say a lot of things, Rick. It's part of the job. Delgado was a very successful man. Successful men in that part of the world tend to be, well, call it security conscious. Not many people could have done this thing solo. So you went running after a myth? Myth? No, no. It merely caught my attention. One of my CIA friends was also intrigued. The opera incident heightened our curiosity. Have a look. You think that was 47 too? We knew it was. We were so confident we set up an international task force to hunt him down and destroy him. Even assuming this guy exists, he's still just an assassin. What's the big deal? The big deal? He's the perfect clone. His DNA is a how-to manual for any cloning lab in the world. With Mr. 47 in their clutches, There'd be nothing to stop a rogue state from building an entire platoon of 47s. A whole army. These public statements you've been making against cloning, is this what it's all about? Of course. But surely you can't oppose all the uses of cloning. The medical advances, the possible curing of- Medicine won't do us much good if we're all the slaves of some clone army dictatorship, will it? Off the record, Jack. You're not serious. You have no idea how serious. That's why we had to eliminate 47. Having him on the loose was just too dangerous. Why not go after whoever created him? Oh, we did. 
But whenever we got too close, our agents got killed. By 47? See for yourself. Eleven forty-five. I'm sorry we have to meet like this. It's dangerous to meet in person. You're normally more prudent. What's going on? Looks like we've got a mole at the agency. Here's your briefing. Thanks. I'll read it later. How's that wound healing? Fine. Are we done here? One thing. We haven't been able to get a positive ID on the target. There's a government agent in there already, though we think he knows. The price for his knowledge is getting him out alive. And that raises my price. Already factored in. Take this. Designer poisons? The clinic only lets clients out when they're fully recovered or dead. The injection puts its victim into a hibernatory state. Apply the antidote on the lips to revive them. What if this agent's already dead? I trust you, 47. The money's been transferred to your account. Getting a clearer picture? You had an agent on the inside, and 47 killed him? We've got it on videotape. The incident put us back on 47's tail, which eventually led to his destruction. You actually caught him? We didn't just catch your urban legend. We killed him. I assume you can prove this. I intend to give you incontrovertible evidence. But how? There was a bit player for the mob in a certain witness protection program. He was protected 24-7 by some of the most dedicated professionals we had. 47 came for him anyway. And you killed him? Bring out the car. Wait a second, Jack. Come on. You can't just leave me hanging. Bring the folder. We'll talk on the way. The way where? To your proof. So, you didn't get it? It was quite a blow. That witness possessed information about the Ortmeier files, or their location. Ortmeier files? Dr. Ortmeier ran an underground cloning lab in Romania. We raided it as soon as we learned about it, but someone beat us to it. They'd ransacked the place, grabbed all the files, and killed everyone that worked there. Even Ortmeier. But that was the least of our concerns. What do you mean? We did find some papers later. Enough to prove that Dr. Ordmeyer created Mr. 47. No one else has successfully created a Class I human clone. Dr. Ortmeier literally wrote the book. And somebody stole it? Not just somebody. Where's the nurse? Whoa. Sorry. I... I don't like being dependent. Something as simple as lighting a damn cigar, it's just... I apologize. Could you... Of course. So, who stole the research? We found a surveillance tape. It clearly showed Mr. 47 killing the guards and snapping poor Dr. Ortmeier's neck. So 47 wanted to build his own clones? More likely, he wanted to sell the research to the highest bidder. It lit a fire under everyone's asses. We threw everything we had at him. It's all there.
There's the handoff. Follow that briefcase, 47. It's the only lead we've got. Thanks. Hmm. Code red. You forgot your tip. That's all right. I insist. On the table by the bathroom. Whose story? 47's. I've been looking forward to this for a long, long time. It's not his funeral. It is. But you didn't get him in Mississippi. No. We got close, but he slipped away. He knew we were on him, now. He was running scared. Where'd he go? Where does anyone go for a last desperate roll of the dice? It suited me. I had some business to attend to. Those missions out in the sticks may have bought us some time, but things are still deteriorating rapidly. We're still losing agents. You got the briefing? Yesterday. Got the pictures right here. Mohammed bin Faisal Al Khalifa, his scientist Tariq Abdul Latif, and Henrik Schmutz of South Africa. Interesting trio. The DNA angles disturbing. This may tie into the group that's trying to liquidate us. Hey, 47! Ow, oh, hey! It's me! It's me! Stop! It's me! I'm cool! Come on! Ah. What are you doing here? Just relax, please. You're my only hope. There's no one else. Your only hope for what? They're gonna kill the president. Don't want him re-elected. He'll legalize cloning, ruin their plans. Who are they? You know... them. Already got a cloning program. Want the technology to themselves. They can have it. I don't play politics. Now give me one good reason why I shouldn't put a bullet in your head. I've got millions. Got the diamonds back there. Red suitcases worth millions. All yours. What's the job? They want to hit the president in three days. In the White House. You get in there, protect him. Take the assassins out. Show me the money. <gasps> Thank God. Here's some. You get the rest after. What do you say? I'll contact you with instructions on how to get me the rest of the money up front. And how to get me the mission details. But then how can I be sure that- If you're on the level, I'll do the job. If you're not, you won't be needing the money. So that's the deal. The dirty CIA agent will be there to drop the high-tech weapons on the host. Eliminate both of them. Anything else? It'll probably be crawling with other enemy operatives. Have you identified them? They're paid by the franchise. The franchise? That's Parchesi's group. What's their business here tonight? I think you are. You and I are all that's left of the Agency 47, and I doubt I'll survive much longer. I'm sorry to hear that. Has my fee been transferred? More than usual. I'm splitting what's left of the Agency's resources with you. Good luck, 47. It's been quite a ride. Good luck yourself.
Sorry, gentlemen. My niece's birthday. Happy birthday, sweetheart. Did you get your present? It's everything I've ever wished for. My own access card to the White House. Is the roof alarm taken care of? Yes, Pumpkin. Everything is just fine. I'm afraid Uncle has to go now. I'll call you back later and we can talk all about your party. <laughs> you know how little girls are. I thought you said you killed him. It was a very brief reprieve. We raided the agency a few days ago. You got him at his office? No. But the office has been closed and will not open again. You got the Ortmeier files. They're still in circulation. But we learned that the files are almost entirely useless without a fresh bone marrow sample from 47. So even dead, he's a threat. Only until he's cremated. About 20 minutes from now. How'd you finally get him? He got overconfident and greedy. He took on the most difficult, most highly paid assassination attempt in history. The presidential attack? The very one you asked about at the start of our conversation. Ready to hear how it really went down? We're all quite pleased to have you on this assignment, Mr. 47. The nation's gratitude... Skip the patriotism, Smith. Of course. <laughs> have you read the briefing? Not yet. Give me the big picture. The Vice President of the United States is plotting with Mark Parchezzi. I assume you're familiar with him? I know his work. Good. They're planning to assassinate the President as soon as he gets back from Los Angeles. Another drink, sir? Please. There's more detailed info on both men in the briefing. Can I do anything else for you? I'm looking forward to finally working with you. I'll contact you if I need more information. Beyond that, never contact me in person again. Me, 47. Diana. What are you doing here? Easy. I had to sneak in. The place is surrounded by hundreds of SWAT members right now. They're getting ready to move in. I had to warn you. There's still time for you to escape. I've got a plan. I don't buy it. You've got nothing to gain here. The smart play would have been getting out of the country. Out of the country? We're dealing with a franchise here, 47. Borders don't stop them. You're my last chance. You know my terms. Cash on the nail. Don't you get it? You have to fight them. But if you try to do it alone, you're a dead man. Death is always a risk. Read carefully, 47. It's a bold plan. Where is this wheelchair guy right now? Ah! Ah! Bitch! Ah! Whatever I said, and you would have lost. You'll buy me one more night. We've got four minutes before he's called, people. Let's move. I've never actually killed a man before. It was surprisingly pleasant. Very nicely done, Diana. You've earned my trust. Welcome to the franchise. 
I'm sure we'll find an appropriate role for you in the organization. A woman like yourself is entitled to a very special role, indeed. assassination attempt was the most reported story since 9-11. How can you expect me to believe it? I don't expect you to believe anything but your eyes. This videotape confirms his presence in the White House moments before the assassination. I'll be damned. If cloning is an outlaw, we'll all be damned. Who actually killed him? That's the most delicious irony of all. He stumbled coming over the compound wall, severed his spinal cord on the rocks. The world's most nefarious assassin died of clumsiness. How'd you confirm his identity? His DNA includes signature sequences from the five men of the Ortmeier project. It's biologically impossible for anyone but the Ortmeier clone to have that DNA. You're giving me all this as an exclusive. Why me? We admire your objectivity, Rick. Thank you. Don't mention it. We need to get to the chaplain. 47's ashes are going to take pride of place on my mantle. Chaplain! Chaplain! Yes, Your Majesty. Almost all of our resources are online again. No, I'm afraid he's not, Your Majesty. We seem to have completely lost track of him. Johnson. Welcome, Mr. Johnson. Welcome. May I check your briefcase? No, I'll keep it. I've heard interesting things about your establishment. I'd like to see what you have to offer. Preferably in the back. Uh, of course, sir. Right this way. You're my friend, so I'll let you have it. But as your friend, I beg you not to use it. He'll get the job done. He always does. Nothing can stop him. Anything between him and his target goes down. But you can't call him off. There's no duel. No time out. Unspilled. Once you call that number, blood is on your hands. <laughs> 